so with today's video I'm going to declutter my life. I'm going to be decluttering some clothes today. Here I have my sweaters. Let's go through them. This first piece right here is a cardigan. It is three quarter sleeve length. It is from Ardeen. It's really nice, but if you've been watching me for any period of time, I sweat like a pig. And because this is a light brown color, when you sweat, the armpits turn dark brown. So this is going to go to Goodwill. Next is an Aeropostale hoodie. I don't really like this kind of sweater very much. I don't like when it shows the brand. So this is also going. I've had this for such a long time and the armpit area is discolored now because I literally wore it so much and it's white so of course it will stain darker so this is also gonna go. I don't have many zip up hoodies so this is just plain black it also is kind of like soft material so I'll keep this. This sweater is from Ardeen. It is super, super neon coral and it's really, really pretty, but I sweat and when I sweat, this armpit area turns to a darker shade. I've literally worn this one time because the one time I wore it, I was sweating and my sister was like, you're sweating and I was like, okay, well, never again. So it's going. This is another simple black hoodie, also from Mardine. This one's not like furry, but I'm gonna keep it. This sweater is a white ombre into mint green. This is so incredibly soft. This is also from Mardine. I really like the color of this. It's actually a really, really nice winter warm sweater, so I'm going to keep this. Lastly is a sweater that I loved back in the day. Just simple gray. I wore this all the time. But again, because it's gray, because I sweat, it turns to a darker shade of gray in the underarm area. So it's got to go. Some black shorts. I got these so long ago. I used to use these for gym class in high school and there's holes in the sides because they were still too big that I had to safety pin like two inches to make them tighter. So this got to go. These are boxers. Yes, female boxers from Licenza. This is too big for me and it falls off so I'm just going to pass it along. Shirts. These are not all my shirts but again we're just gonna roll with it. So first thing here is a very wrinkled v-neck. Has horizontal stripes, white, gray, and mint. I got it for the mint, of course. One thing you might not know is I absolutely hate short sleeve shirts. That's why I always wear camis because I like my underarms to breathe. I literally never wear this. Okay, it's going. Done. This is also another one of those shirts. It is white with silver sparkles from Garage. The actual glitter is like scratchy and like it's not soft and fuzzy on the inside so no so this next shirt has skulls on it it is pink white and gray it has long sleeves I haven't worn this in quite some time I think I'm over this phase so goodbye this is from American Eagle they were giving these out for free one year I don't like t-shirts this size is an extra small, which is still pretty big. American Eagle does not have the smallest sizes. They are still quite big on me. And it's just like way too boobalicious as well. So, no. This cami, I do love camis, but this is orange. 
and I'm not a big fan of orange. So we're going to pass that along. This shirt, I love this shirt is light pink and the top is mesh. I'm going to keep this. Next is another cami. This one is cheetah print and it's all different colors. To be honest, I feel like this is so not my style anymore. I still wear it sometimes, like if everything is dirty, but I don't think I don't think I'm in love anymore. I think we're gonna pass it along. Next is a Toronto Blue Jays 2015 shirt. I got this when I went to a Blue Jays game in August, and this is literally so freaking big. I don't go to Toronto Maple Leafs games that often. I have a hat. I feel like I need to pass this along. It's just like not something I would wear on the daily, so I literally wore it once and it was free. Sorry, but no. This is a v-neck. What's nice about this shirt is it cinches all right here, so it makes the boobs look really nice. And then the bottom part actually flares out, so this part isn't skin tight, which is really nice and it's really pretty. It's a little booby if you have big boobs, like it's super like, whoa, boobies everywhere. But it's nice, so I'm going to keep it. This is just a plain white cami. I purchased this one because the last one I got black nail polish on, so I'm going to keep this. Alright. <laughs> like, literally so many jeans. Okay. So, I guess we'll start with this one. These are American Eagle, as I just mentioned with that American Eagle shirt. American Eagle does not fit as I would like it to. I only have two pairs. I keep them because they're just not as tight as the ones I own where they're just a little bit more comfortable than like the super hella skinny ones. So I'm just going to keep these. This jean right here and this jean are the same jean I bought two of the same pair just because I loved it so much I had this one for like a year before I bought the second pair I obviously bought two so I love them I guess we will just keep them these jeans are so old and worn like they're so faded and like the butt is super light now because all that sitting I haven't worn these in quite some time I'm just going to pass these on these ones I've had for a long time. They have some distressed areas. The pockets have some detail. I honestly don't wear it though. So I'll pass these along. We'll go into some leggings. These leggings are literally like shiny. I used to wear these as long johns, like I would wear these under other pants to keep warm when I would have to take the bus to school, but because I don't have that problem anymore, I'm going to pass these on, and now I have a real pair of long johns. Next I have these, these are literally just like a medium wash or regular straight jean, but uh, I'm over it so we're going to pass them along. These are just plain black leggings from Garage, so I'm going to keep these. These are pleather leggings from Dynamite. Dynamite and Garage are sister stores. This is the butt area. I don't know if you can tell, but there's definitely like some wear. I like them though, so I'll keep them for as long as I can use them for. I also have a gray pair. I like leggings so I can wear like an oversized sweater with them, cover the butt, stuff like that. Comfortable. These are my only black pair of jeans so I'm going to keep them. And most of my jeans are skinny by the way. So these jeans I've had since the like 8th or 7th grade or something like that. I don't even know where these are from. I think I'm going to pass these along. And then this one is also kind of like that other one. These two pairs to me look so similar. 
So maybe I'll just keep one. This is a skirt. I loved this skirt. It's just like flowy. I'm gonna keep this. This shirt, I've got to keep this shirt. I purchased this in Greece, so there's no way that I can find anything like it. It is super, super low, but I usually wear something underneath it. This shirt is also from Greece. It is black. It has like some cinching right here at the bust. And then you can put like a belt right here. And then there's like some just plain black space and then it goes into lace. This is super long. Is when I wear this, I usually like fold it down just so it's not as long. Because I do like the lacy part. My sister bought this for me. This shirt is a nice light mint shirt and has a bunch of lace detailing. I really like this. With this shirt, I usually have to like fold the bottom part when I wear it just because it's so long. So I'll keep it. Is a skirt. Wow. So wrinkly. So this is from Sirens. Now there's two things that are deal breakers for me. First of all, it's not a straight edge at the top. As you can see it like V's right here, which I don't like. It's very strange. It's like when you wear it, it's like a V in the front. It's just weird. I don't like that. Also, this is hella see-through, so this is gonna go. Alright, so that is everything. I feel like it's a pretty good pile. Keep in mind, it's not everything. I do still have some in my closet in the dirty laundry bin, and I also do have some clean clothes downstairs in the laundry basket. So it's not everything, but it's a really, really good pile of clothes in my opinion. So I'm happy with this and I will catch you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Like if you enjoyed. Toodles!